More than two and a half years since he last wore the gold jersey, Drew Mitchell is back in the Wallabies fold. You know, it's almost like my first day back at school and, uh, um, you know, having to get to know everyone and, you know, being that guy that doesn't really know all the jokes and, you know, all the, all the things that are going on. So it's, um, I mean, gets probably just on the side and have to try and work our way back into it, I think. But he won't be given any leeway, especially during opposed training sessions, when the 125 kilogram bulk of Tankeli Nayuravoro is lining him up. I was just speaking to him. I, I play his, uh, his cousin plays for, for Clermont, uh, Nalungo, who's of similar physique. So I um, played him a few months, uh, probably maybe six weeks ago, and he um, he's also not got much of a sidestep, just a, a good bump on him. Cousins as well as Fiji and friends, Naira Voro to feel right at home alongside Henry Spate and Tevita Kurundrani. We've all um, spoken a lot during the season, me, Tevita and uh, Henry. And yeah, it's just um, we were just speaking about it, but uh, I was just kind of wanting to wait and see and believe it. So. Samu Karevi sharing Fiji and heritage as well. The red centre bursting onto the scene in 2015. Uh, for myself, I just feel like I'm growing every day in every session. Um, you know, just, I guess the hard work finally is paying off, but you know, it's not the end here. There's still a lot to go, and I'm just excited for next week now. While Karevi's preparing for a debut, Greg Holmes has waited eight years to get back into the setup. Well, I definitely haven't dropped off the uh, face <laughs> of the earth. Just, um, yeah, you know, I had a few injuries, fell out of contention with the Wallabies, and you know, I've had a couple of good back to back seasons with the Reds, and lucky enough to get another chance to go into a training camp. and push my case for another world of spot. Will Genia almost certain to grab a spot for the Springboks clash in what would be his final farewell to Suncorp Stadium. Yeah, I've had wonderful memories here, obviously playing for the Reds, but also the Wallabies. So um, hopefully we can, whoever is playing, can, can, can perform and, and get a good win for the Wallabies uh, against the Springboks.